Hey guys, and welcome back to NASCAR 06 Total Team Control with me, John. So sorry about the last episode. I don't know. It's like my whole rhythm was off for that whole situation. But um, anyway, today we are going to be jumping into um, a truck race. Actually, maybe two truck races. We will see. We will see. Um, but difficulty is back on veteran. Um, although that didn't really help me for that second race that I did in the last video, but whatever. Anyway, um, am I too close to my mic? Sorry. <laughs> uh, but anyway, so yes, let's begin. All right, no practice on the track, no qualifying. <laughs> let's do this. This place is always kind of loose too. I probably should have uh, tightened the truck up a little bit. Um... Yeah. <laughs> and I know typically I would do the hood view and stuff like this, you know, my NASCAR races and stuff. But um until I get comfortable again with the controls, I, I think Oh my gosh, why did they all stop? I'm so sorry. <laughs> Dang man. Um no. Seriously, dang. Uh, but anyway, yeah, until until I get comfortable with the controls, I'm going to hold off on switching to that view. And instead, um, I'll be using the full view like this. That is okay. Probably by the time I get to the Nationwide and Cup cars, I will be using the hood view again, but... Anyway, um, so yeah. So by the time you're seeing this, of course, it'll be the day of the second chase race at Loudoun, New Hampshire. Um, but for me, I just saw the first chase race yesterday. And, uh, last night, I should say, because it went really late because of the rain. But what a crazy race. So many things, so many things changed due to stuff going wrong for people and stuff going right for some people um whoop 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 oh gosh it uh it looks like I was right before uh I don't know if I actually said it in video but I, I know I talked about it with some other people and I thought that this was wow this truck is tight not loose <laughs> and I thought this was gonna be a Matt Kenseth kind of year because he was doing things he's never done before, which is win lots of poles and win lots of races. Um, and so far, that's staying true. He won the first chase race and uh, is currently the points leader. So that's pretty awesome. Um, I'm okay with it. I'm actually really, really happy for him. And uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I don't know if you could see that. My truck was just freaking out. Wow. All right, so I'm gonna have to pit. Probably, uh, I think I'll go one more time around. Make sure that I can make it on fuel and all that. Get past halfway. Truck's pretty fast though. Once I get it to uh, stop fishtailing. Uh, but anyway, so yeah. Some people had some bad luck. Dale Earnhardt Jr. had some misfortune and engine failure, which has buried him deep in the points. And I was sorry to see that. Um, Joey Logano, who did not get punished for his team's crazy stuff at Richmond. No! I clicked the button too soon. I don't know what my pit options are. No! Anyway, uh, he didn't get punished for his team's crazy choices at Richmond, but had an engine failure at uh, Chicago, which has buried him also deep in the points, so maybe it's karma. Come on, pit guy. Jeez. Um, anyway, <laughs> yeah, maybe it's karma. Come on. Get me out of the pits. Um... And some other guys were up and down for different reasons. 
Kurt Busch have had a very very solid run which was pretty cool um, Jeff Gordon likewise very solid so it was interesting to see that all unfold it took <laughs> what seven eight hours for that race with all the rain delay but yeah it was it was over eight I think um, so it was a long experience but oh well all right so I lost a lot of time getting on pit road I lost a lot of time on pit road so unless we get a caution we are pretty much not gonna have a good finish I'm gonna assume <laughs> I mean, we're going to pass this group on pit road. I guess. Well, just a couple of them. Alright. <laughs> yeah, we really need a caution is what we need. I really... I messed up getting pit road and then... Apparently I had the thing on that repairs damage even though it's just visible damage so that wasted even more time in the pits <sighs> One day I will be good at this game I swear <laughs> All right. Let's Try to make up some ground though because we do have a pretty fast truck Whoa, 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 whoa. get get out of here. It's a bad spot to be entering the corner from Oh, dang it. I knew that was going to happen. Alright. Mm -mm. Terry Cook. Stop. Alright. Going to the outside, which you can easily do here in Charlotte. Probably for the best. The way this truck is handling, anyway. Okay, let off a little bit, get back out. Oh, caution. Might have a chance to pick up a few more spots. Maybe we could get us another top 10, that'd be nice. Oh, it's Terry Cook. That's what he gets for giving me a hard time. <laughs> wow, that truck was just doing all kinds of crazy things. <laughs> all right. No, not pitting. Be nice if they all pitted. No, they didn't. <laughs> It's not like uh, NASCAR 2013, they don't all pit like every two seconds. Wait, what? Oh, I forgot. There's no green white checker. This is the old days. Well, crud. <laughs> uh, well, that wasn't a great finish, was it? Oh, well. Apparently he had a bad day too. Well. Alright, so now we're going to get to qualify the truck and try to get a better setup perhaps. So let's go to Dover. Let's get something accomplished. Alright, now Dover is a very tricky place. Hopefully... Uh, I'll be able to figure out a good setup for it. And I will see you guys in a second. Well, this is not going to be good. I hit the wall big time. got super tight. Let's see if we can make up for it. Oh, this truck is crazy. Oh. Uh, Right, this is the one that I hit it really hard on and messed up my first lap pretty bad. Yeah, this one's better. Slowed it down some. was able to pull out seventh. Not too bad. I'll take it. <laughs> this is going to be really hard with other trucks though. Really hard. Uh, let's try to fix this. Alright, we're going to take... 
like a round and a half out. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Up that for to make it a little looser and to make the tire wear better. All right, that's what we're gonna go with. Let's see how we do in the race. Let's just make sure that our setup is still here. Six, round and a half down. Yep. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Let's be very, very careful. Like overly cautious. Until we get a good feel for things. <laughs> Make kind of whoa! Dang it! Did you see that? I think I I did. I clipped the apron. Dang it, man! I just got sucked right around. That's crazy. Ah! No, I'm not pitting. That was annoying. <laughs> At least they froze the field. All right. Not clip the apron. Stay a little bit up off of it. No, no, no. Wow, truck just says I'm going down here and now I'm going up here. What the frick? <laughs> Alright. Yeah, things are just not the same as they are in the Wayland Modified series, although that didn't even go well for me last time, but. Okay, now the truck's super tight again. What is going on with. Wow. Oh, for crying out loud. Uh, that's annoying. That's very annoying. Alright, what, what lap are we at? I think I'll go ahead and pit. Maybe I'll be able to pull out some kind of a strategy. But my tires are probably shot anyway. Actually, I do have an idea. Um, I'm going to loosen it up a little bit more. I'm going to up this more. Let's just see what happens. We don't. Uh, whatever. We're the only one pitting, so go ahead. Um, yeah, let's see what happens with this. I have an idea. Well, that was a 21 second pit stop. <laughs> Alright. Oh gosh. Why aren't they going? Jeez. Sorry, dude. Alright, so we're just going to take it easy. I'm trying to pull some strategy here. Let's see what happens. Let's not get in the wall. Let's just take it nice and slow. Wow, they're pitting already. This could work out perfectly for us. Let's just not do anything stupid. This truck still doesn't handle very well. But the reason I upped the tire pressure was so that I could maybe go two tires or no tires. If the, the durability stayed up good. Plus, if I save enough fuel, I might not have to pit again. Wouldn't that be something? This truck stinks. <laughs> Seriously. But if there's no caution, this could work out for us. Nice and smooth. I'm not even trying to catch them, really. I'm just trying not to do anything stupid like that, but. Nice and easy. If I could save fuel, that would be great. Wow. Now all of a sudden I'm, I'm sideways loose. I have a feeling this is going to come back to bite me now. Wow. 
Okay. Look at me skidding loose. <laughs> Alright. Shouldn't have taken out all that wedge then. Just need to survive, you know? This is ridiculous. Why? I'm mean, off the gas and it's sideways. What the frick? Not even on the gas. So this is just using up the tires. Why? Why? I was completely off the gas. Just survive, John. You don't even have to go fast. You just need to... Just keep making laps. Wish I had a more accurate gauge of my fuel. Oh, it hit yellow now. There's no way I'm going to make it then. Away. But how did those other people go to make it that pitted right after me? No idea. Gall oh, dang it. Just hang in here. Maybe get some track position, get a caution or something. Maybe something will help. Oh my gosh, I'll be the caution at this rate. This truck stinks really badly <laughs> yeah tires are in the yellow now well, I'm in the lead or I was and wow but wait is, this might benefit me <laughs> I did not do that on purpose but this might benefit me wow that was so bad so loose absolutely ridiculously spinning out loose not my fault. Yep, pit. Let's see what happens. This may have worked out perfectly. Alright, we're going back up. Um, No, don't worry about that. We're going to get some grip back. Alright. Because I'd honestly rather be tight at this point than, than sideways loose off every corner. 17 second pit stop. Not too bad, I guess. Oh, yeah, this did work out. I am third. Oh, yeah. Here with Ricky Craven and some fictional character. Oh. Uh, Alright, never mind. <laughs> now the truck's tight as heck again. I said I'd rather be tight, but not this tight. How are they all in the lead lap? What the frick? Oh, it's that guy who was mad at me from last time, isn't it? <laughs> Dang it, man. What a jerk. No. Alright, let's just see if we can figure this out. It's super tight. I don't even care about restart rules. Get out of my way. Oh, that was the end. 10th place, yes! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I'm so bad at this game all of a sudden. Why? I don't know. And you thought I was ready for Legend? Come on. All right. Well, I got a top 10 with some strategy and some terrible handling. I've never been good at Dover, though, so I've got to keep that in mind. I've always had problems with this track as far as getting the setup right in all NASCAR games pretty much um, so I don't feel too bad about it I guess um, finished out of all my teammates so that's got to count for something right alright moving on with our lives <laughs> Uh-oh, we got in trouble. Yeah, you fool, you put me in the wall. I don't care if I put you in the wall first. You deserved it. You stopped in front of me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that parting shot in there. 
Uh, Alright, so that is the end of this kind of long episode of NASCAR 06. When they're longer like this, I don't think I'll be able to pair it with uh, F1 2012. Oh, he's mad. I don't care. Confront him. Just on him, you know? <laughs> um, alright. But yeah, uh... So yeah, this will probably be the only video see that you'll see Sunday. Hope you enjoyed it. And next time, another truck race at Texas. Uh, I think I'm a little better there. Still, some of these tracks are really tricky to set up properly. Um, so yeah. We do have a modified race that isn't going to conflict with the truck race. Well, that's nice for a change. And then another modified race. Wait. That. Oh, I see. That's the qualifying. Anyway, um, let's look at our standings real quick. Obviously, the modified isn't changing because we haven't run that race lately. Where am I at the bottom? Because I missed some races, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, we have a teammate in the top ten in points, so that's something. Uh, Cup is being led by Jeff Gordon. Interesting. Mm -hmm. And Shane Mill leading the nationwide. That is bittersweet to see. Uh, for those of you not familiar with his story, he got in a terrible sprint car wreck that has left him... Uh, paralyzed, but he is attempting to overcome all of that, and it is a pretty cool story. But, um, anyway, yeah, that is all. I will see you guys next time for more. Bye!